again, my name's Gabe Zolna. Well, you want to spend the next 9 minutes and 30 seconds watching this attached video. Most people don't even know what it is, but they're going to find out. Title, FCC Repeal Net Neutrality. But it gets worse, exposing the corruption and truth of net neutrality. Now, you've heard me say this, it's just a matter of time before they take away the internet. Well, that time's about here. They talk about, in this video, about the chairman, Ajit Pai, P-A-I. Now here's a guy that makes over $400,000 a year. He's a federal employee. Mm -hmm. He has up the FCC, Federal Communication Commission. And he and his cronies that were probably paid off by lobbyists, well, they've gone ahead and repealed net neutrality. And you're going to hear that, well, he used to work for Verizon. And you're going to hear how Verizon dramatically benefits, as do other companies. You're going to be paying a fee, a whole lot of fees, to access what we've all gotten accustomed to accessing for free. You see, what they've realized, they meaning the cult that is behind all this, the internet allowed us to learn about them. We learned about the Twin Towers. We learned who was responsible for the Twin Towers. We learned that the Saudi nationals had nothing to do with it. They were just patsies. Just like Adam Lenza was a patsy. He never even existed. <laughs> You're going to learn how lobbyists direct the future. How many times have I said that lobbyists should be banned? They should be made illegal. They influence these lawmakers with money, whether it's in the form of tips on pre-IPOs or prostitutes or whatever. They're very good at it. You're going to learn how we really are getting totally screwed. Now, it still has to go to Congress for final closure. And what do we know about Congress? <laughs> well, we know that more than half of the members that are there are multi-millionaires, and very few came in with money. So how do they make money? Well, ask John Boner. He'll tell you investments. Ask Speaker Paul Ryan. He'll tell you investments in the stock market. Ask Nancy Pelosi. She'll tell you investments in the stock market. As Diane Feinstein, she'll tell you investments in the stock market. You can go right down the line. The newbies are the ones that are poor, but give them time. How many millions do you think that the senator from Arizona, Jeffrey DeFlake Flake from Snowflake, you know, the one that's going to retire, how many millions do you think he's got stashed away? How about Trent Franks? Hmm? You know, the guy that wanted to pay $5 million to one of his staff members so he could knock her up? <laughs> well, I mean, that's really what he wanted to do. Now, how much do you think he's left Congress with? How about $55 million? And he was dead ass broke when he went in to Congress in 2002 or 2003. He lost his home in foreclosure and he lost his car for repossession. Folks, you got to be brain dead like McCain not to see what's been going on and is going on. This net 
neutrality is going to take away our first amendment rights. Why? Because a lot of people won't be able to afford to use it. <laughs> and it'll have so many restrictions, many of us won't even understand how to use it. You think that Congress is not going to push it through? You're delusional. This is a very big step in taking away our First Amendment rights. And I know what that's all about. Google and YouTube took mine away when they took down 18,300 of my videos. I want you to watch this and you tell me what you think. You sure as hell know what I think. All these YouTubers, this one here, Bright Insight, 235,000 subscribers. Well, soon, very few of them are going to have any subscribers. Because the subscribers won't be able to afford to use the Internet. That's the plan. Keep them dumb and stupid. You think not? Well, think whatever you like. You know what I think, and you know why I think what I think, don't you? You might want to pass this one along while you still can. Soon, the light will be turned off on the Internet.